Hello friends, welcome. I have created two projects, blade.test and in this project I have installed the Breeze package with blade and here inertia.test I have installed Breeze with inertia and Vue.js and I have created these two projects because I want to show you this uh, package from Spati, Laravel login link which is going to help us to quickly log into our local environment project. So when developing an app, we can just go and add a link here on the login form and quickly log in either with as an admin or as a regular user. So we don't need to fill the form and maybe we forget the password or the email. And is also for Blade and for the inertia as well. So here we have an example. So in your login view, you can add the X login link component to show the login link and the dot the env local will be will make sure that the links are only rendered in the local environment and here is how it's going to look so this package is meant for uh, local development and probably shouldn't be used in any publicly reachable environment so only on the local environment make sure you to add env local and let's go and install on both of our projects. I'm going to copy this and the Blade project I have inside, inside the PHP store. So let's open the terminal here and I'm going to paste that in. And the inertia I have inside the code.js. So let's paste also here that Next, let's run the artisan vendor publish. Paste that. And also let's open the... Okay, so here is the config file. We have allowed environments to local by default. And what is great is here, automatically is going to create a um, missing user. So we don't need to have the create a new user and then go and log in. We just need to add that link and it's going to automatically, if we don't have that user, it's going to create. Okay, if you want, you can also run the PHP Artisan Vendor Publish and tag the login link views if you want to change something on the login link component. And let's copy this command. Here's just the env local x login link and paste on the login blade. So I'm going to open the login blade here and I'm going to add up here, not inside the form because it's going to run the form, but above the form. And let's see now if I come here. Yeah, it's going to look something like this. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to open also the table plus and here is the database for the blade version and we don't have any user so let's test now if i refresh and just click developer login as you can see we are logged in and it's redirect us to the home page okay now if you don't like that you can override and change the redirect url so let's copy this and paste it on the link component as parameter redirect url and specify in here the route dashboard and let's go and try now developer login and we are redirected to the dashboard also you can add the email or the key which here is going to be the id of the user also user attributes for example label and add class okay now let's see for the inertia js here we have an example on the handle inertia request. We need to add the environment app environment. So let's copy that. And because it's going to make sure if we are in the local, uh, not here, we need to open the code. And let's open here the handle inertia request. And I'm going to paste it right here. Save, close, next. We need to import the link and add the login link component and 
say here v if page props environment is equal to the local okay so let's copy first this and let's open oh no i just need to copy the import first so let's open the login page inside the resources js pages out and first let's import the login link and then let's uh, add the login link component right here so we the page props environment is local it's going to show that link and let's see now here we are in the inertia test refresh go to the login and yeah we have login here and we are logged in go to the dashboard test user logout let's do the same thing so we can add a class or also add a redirect url here the same we had on the blade and let's do that copy and paste it here inside the link paste that in and let's save go to the project and refresh go to the login and yeah here we have click and now it's going to redirect us to the dashboard okay so thank you spotty for creating such a good packages this is going to help also me when we show you a demo project so just go and add that link and then log in instead of fill in the form that's it about this video friends i hope you enjoy and don't forget if you like like the video and subscribe to my channel for more video like this all the best